Hey there, we're back for our playthrough of Gauntlet 4. We just came from the Earth Tower. You can see above our gold counter we have the Earth Coat of Arms. I forgot to notice we got a bunch of experience for killing the dragon there. So we're going to boost our shot power. Uh, we'll do that twice. Usually one of the more important stats. The next tower we're going to hit is going to be the Wind Tower, I think. Kind of fits with my idea of musical prog progression here, because I feel like the music is still sort of mysterious and it gives off this air that we I'm not sure quite where we're going, but we're a little more confident in what we're doing here. I don't know, that's just what I think about it. That's some good music for the Sega Genesis, I think. We've cleared the first few floors. We're going to come this way for floor 4. This is another one of those floors where we're going to have to make two trips to be able to clear everything out. We'll, come we'll go ahead and take care of death right now. And then those demons. Let's take that one up too. Go this way and take that generator out. And there, there's all these demons around it. The generator I took out over here was a lobber generator. And those can get pretty irritating if you don't have a good line of shot for them. Not getting anywhere there. And we'll take these ghosts out and we can hop over here. See if you don't have the teleporter quite on the screen enough, it just doesn't quite register. Get up here without taking too much damage. Just kind of letting the treasures act as a bit of a shield. And there's one trap down. And there's another we can get. See all the traps on this floor are kind of opening up this little central area here. So I'm kind of tapping the shot button here so I can kind of hold my position. Oh dear. Took three of those ghosts. That's no good. And we can't really do anything else here. We'll grab some food while we're at it. And we'll go back down and come at this from the other side. I think I missed a treasure over there. Oh well. Come on. There we go. Invisible. We can take everything out real quick before they notice us. Those ghosts. See, we're starting to take a bit more damage now that we've gotten through one tower. Everything's generating a little faster, a little higher level, sometimes. Ooh, we got all those. One more trap. Take that generator out. I'll leave those there, they won't give me an experience. Take out all the generators we can. And move on to the next floor. I'm not sure if death gives any bonus experience in the quest mode or not. I know he does give like a huge bonus for your arcade mode playthroughs, gives like a thousand points every time you kill him. Potions are much harder to come by in the arcade mode. Ah. Mm. A little more. I don't need to take everything out, but the extra experience is good.
Alright, I think that's all. Mm, let's grab the treasures too. At least I'll leave those behind. I think that's everything here. The only exit to the next floor, the fifth floor, is right here next to this demon. It will be invisible as we go up. It works out great because there's a lot of demons here. This is one big long spirally teleporty area. Got all the generators we can. There's no real set way to get through this area. You can get to pretty much any point from anywhere. Although I really probably should not have come to the central area so early. Lots of ghosts, and in the stream tiles, it, it just makes it very difficult to not take a hit here. Oh, we can take out these generators. Oh, that wasn't where I wanted to go. And then we have this to deal with. There we go. Oh, oh no. Very bad. Yeah, all the little solo treasures you'll see in these middle hallways, they're all going to be death treasures mimics. And there's one of the traps. Let's go this way. No more shooting. These grunts are getting very tough to kill. Guys, get to that trap. We can continue on. So not shooting now. We've taken a lot of damage on this floor. That's alright, we'll recover. Continue here. Take out all these ghosts. Take out another mimic. See if we can... I wanted to get into there, but these teleporters are so close together they don't always take you where you want to go. He's out. I want to get that demon before he's in any trouble. Back in here. Oh, we're in the center now. Head out. Some extra potions. Can't get anything from in here. Go this way. That's sort of where I wanted to go. Come on. That out. And let's I guess I gotta go this way. Oh, not where I wanted to be, not where I wanted to be. That was a lot of damage. Okay, I think we're just about done here. One minute. Oh, one more. And let's see, I need to this one, there we go. Oh, took a hit. And it looks like we're done here. Got to go all the way around, because again, there's only one staircase to go around. And we're going to cut here, and the next video will pick up on floor 6. We shall see you then.